located just northeast of San Antonio, Universal City is known as the gateway to Randolph Air Force Base. Yeah, and the music is played by the Oklahoma Moho Rimba Group. The group is comprised of local UC students led by music teacher Bonnie Anderson, and the group is looking forward to performing at Carnegie Hall later this year, which is a testament, Delane, to just how well they do. That's right. Well, they're awesome. In. My name is Bonnie Anderson and I'm the elementary music teacher at Coronado Village Elementary. One of my proudest moments as a teacher was when my marimba group took a trip recently to the University of Texas in the Rio Grande Valley for a marimba festival. My students are third through seventh graders, but we were the youngest group of students invited to perform at this event. All the others were college and high school marimba groups and we were the only group featured on their promotional poster. And I was amazed that all the families took the time and the money to go on this trip that was five hours away and stay for two nights. When my students performed on stage, they were the most animated they had ever been. The directors of the other marimba groups and the college students uh, were very impressed and they gave a standing ovation. We had played Zimbabwean style music on Zimbabwean handcrafted marimbas. So it was kind of a coincidence when the next day the college students played traditional Mexican music on handcrafted marimbas from Chiapas, Mexico. And uh, it was as if we had found the Hispanic version of ourselves. My students really enjoyed mingling with their students and they were impressed with each other's instruments and music. and. I liked watching them exchanging ideas and information and one of the college directors even suggested that he could bring his uh, instruments from Chiapas, Mexico to our school and give a summer music camp in samba music. And I think it just really melted my heart to know that we had formed this lifelong bond with these students. I think my biggest challenge came was when our campus became a dual language campus. I immediately enrolled in classes and completed all seven semester courses and took numerous summer conversational courses. I also invested a lot of money in resources to teach Spanish through music. So I enlisted the help of the Spanish speaking students and the teachers and I would teach class in Spanish and they would correct me. And now I feel confident in my ability to teach classes in Spanish and to teach Spanish through music. Our students had the opportunity to be introduced to instruments uh, from various countries as well as music. So that's one of the things too that I think I found her to be an, a big asset in the development of uh, dual language at Coronado. So I did some research and found out that some of the world's best musicians have never read a note of standard notation. So this really affected how I teach. I began teaching ukulele, marimba, and drums by using any means necessary. Uh, sometimes I write out the letter names of the notes or I teach it by rote by modeling, by mirroring, or even putting my hands right on top of their hands. She uses a world drumming technique, also mixed in maybe with a little bit of ORF, with all different techniques, and she blends it together in a very unique way to excite students. 